China's tourism sector has undergone a huge transformation buoyed by years of economic growth. Nowhere is that more apparent than in countries in the network of the Belt and Road Initiative. But for the millions of Chinese tourists eager for new sights and sounds, the adventure abroad isn't without its share of challenges. CCTV Zoya has this story from Turkey. They like us like boom. They like us like boom. This is the most popular show in China and is about traveling abroad. In this episode, Chinese celebrities travel to Turkey. So what exactly draws Chinese to Asia Minor? Religion? Culture? The people? And of course, the food. Turkey is a new market for Chinese tourists, and it's growing fast. The number of Chinese tourists landing in Turkey has gone from thousands five years ago to tens of thousands today. A travel to Turkey poses a certain number of challenges for Chinese. There are few Chinese restaurants, Hello, almost no language guides. Audio service in Chinese. In English. In English, yeah. no Chinese. Sorry, I'm very Chinese. And recent political tensions and attacks aim at Chinese also sparked worry. But the tourism boom has shown no sign of slowing down. Chinese students studying Turkish predict it will keep going up. With the One Belt, One Road initiative and a growing Chinese economy, I'm sure there will be more Chinese tourists choosing to visit Turkey, a beautiful land linking Asia and Europe. Their teacher, Guan Bo, took us on an aerial adventure. Recent years have seen soaring number of Chinese tourists eager to discover new landscapes and experiences. Uh, lots of uh, Chinese people can speak English. We can un understand each other. I can give information to them and I can understand what they want. But discovering a different culture is always challenging. China is such a big country and the world's second largest economy. But people in Turkey actually know very little about China. I'm a little uncomfortable about this. But thanks to him and his students, people in both countries are learning about the other culture. Their school is even considering setting up a Turkish cultural center in Beijing. But there is a lot of things Turkey needs to do to attract Chinese tourists. But with better information and infrastructure, the adventure to Turkey for many Chinese is about to take off. So yeah, Cappadocia, Turkey.